Who cares about little-known Victorian artist Richard Dodd Widdis's Diana, currently in the collection of the Hull Maritime Museum? For me, Widdis is interesting because the work gets to the heart of a range of issues central to life in the early 21st century. Widdis's snow scene takes place in the Arctic and partly explains the mess we find ourselves in, in the midst of increasingly catastrophic climate change. That's because the picture represents the end of the Arctic whaling trade, at least for the city of Hull, with the last Hull whaler trapped in the polar ice. But while we might be reassured to think about the end of whale hunting, the whale oil which was the purpose of the hunt, used to lubricate machinery and illuminate cities, would be replaced by fossil fuel oils that would accelerate global CO2 levels that would ultimately melt the polar ice caps. In addition, what about that little ship's dog, Jip, found looking up longingly at his master towards the bottom of the picture? How do we feel about him? As sorry as we feel for the whalers, as sorry as we feel for the whales hunted by the whalers, and more sorry than we feel for the mammals that find themselves on our dinner plates and in the dishes of our pets, Widdis' Diana poses some interesting, difficult questions.